the cabinetry drawing <clears throat> is similar to what we did for the electronics drawing. I used construction lines, which I made light and I made blue. And um, I drew my big outside rectangle first. And then I started the offset command. So my big outside rectangle was 24, 248 and one half by 106 and three quarters. Let me show you how you draw a line that's 24, 248 and one half. So here we go. I'm going to draw it outward. And then I'm going to type 248 dash one slash two. I think you can see that up there, 248 and one half. Okay, so that's how you do um, fractional inches in AutoCAD, dash, and then the fraction. Okay, so that should help you do that. And so once I did that, then I just started drawing the, I did this uh, seven and Three quarter offset plus three is ten and three quarter offset. That gave me the top line of my cabinets. And then I did offsets for the bottom lines of my cabinets. Now, this is really interesting. This one's not given. It, it just doesn't say what that dimension is. So I went and looked up a refrigerator and found out its range. And then I looked up cabinets and i found a 24 inch cabinet is very common so i made those 24 inch so there's that offset okay and so i i just made little squares uh, i hate it when that happens to me if that ever happens to you here's what you do you log back in and if you do it fairly quickly, you don't lose anything when you leave for more than an hour or two that you lose something. So there we go. Now I'm back up and running. Okay, I got that moved just a little bit. There. Okay, so I just made rectangles for all of my top ones. I actually did offsets and a lot of trimming. And then because I was so confused, I put lots of dimensions in so that I could check them to make sure that I got them right. Okay, so here's this cabinet is as example 29 and three quarters. These ones do line up with this 42 over here. These ones, I think I said I made 24. Uh, two, three, and then this one, actually, see, I still got that one wrong. This one should be deeper. Okay, so I can, if I want to. Draw that line and then put those on the. Correct layer and do a trim. So that's why I like to like make all those little squares so I can go back and check things out. And then this will go straight on through. And later on, I can either hide or eliminate these by turning the layer on or off. Once I do that, of course, it's just to bring in, insert whichever cabinets I've got. Okay. So that's the process. And then, of course, I would do the same thing on the bottom. I would draw in, I would make my items and draw them in and go to it. So this one will take a little bit of time. You may not get all of these things that are assigned done this week. Next week is a short week. There's just three days to it, but that's okay. Uh, you'll be able to get those in there. So anyway. That is our recording of how to do the cabinetry drawing, adding your blocks.